Hello there. Um, I'm the enzyme, and I want to show you something. Um, I want to show you a thing I use for uh, my job, uh, which is uh, I'm a teacher. I'm a teaching school, and sometimes I use Unreal Engine to uh, enhance my lessons so that they are much more interesting for my students. I hope you can hear me well. Okay, never mind. <coughs> Sorry. Anyway, uh, the thing I used uh, Unreal Engine for was a contest, an English contest of knowledge about uh, USA and UK. And I used uh, the PC as a, a source of um, image for my uh, multimedia projector, and I used the tablet as the controller of the contest. Um, so, yeah, I will fire everything up here and here. And the thing is, now right here, I've got my uh, contest client and here I have the server but they are not connected yet so I have to do that. I'll go with open uh, they are connected to Wi-Fi right okay and then just to uh, see if it can yeah it did connect okay so uh, I can use my tablet to control the situation on the on the uh, PC screen. So if I hit start, everything starts like this. And the thing is, I've got controls for all sorts of things: the right answer, the wrong answer, camera for team one, camera for team two, camera for team three. Uh, different light controls, but I didn't use them really. Um, because uh, they're moving by themselves and uh, different cameras for different views. Okay, and the students uh, answer questions in three different um, three different categories, not rounds. Um, and the first round was something like this. So the students could just um, choose the category: the famous people, places. Uh, uh, yeah, holidays and food and basic information and every time they choose a category, a category I just clicked here uh -huh, and the question displayed and then reset, another question, reset, another question, reset. Then I could give my students groups different uh, amount of points and also show them which team was the leading one. Now the, the first um, round was just for, for a warm up, the second round was the real thing. Um, the second round, uh, for the second round I use the tablets for my students as well because um, you can see the wheel here. So what I did, I can, uh, I hid there the uh, the login is disappear. I've always forgot about that. That the, the ball didn't set when I'm and the server, and I was the server. Um, and the students could just swipe their fingers on my tablet and move the wheel. Um, the X was uh, when they uh, rolled the X. Uh, the, the, uh, they couldn't answer any question. Another 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 thing. Uh, roll the uh, wheel again, and I've got the question for one point, so let's get the question um, what's the name of the uh, Prime Minister of England and it seems good to could answer. Now I will choose that for three, uh, question for three and now all sorts of questions uh, with images as you can see uh, more images well, the images are right, right here, and <coughs> the round three was just um, meant to, uh, well, 
in the rank three as my students used a little bells just to hit the bell and they knew the answer for the questions and the questions were um, given one by one just to just to um, somehow oh anyway, finished all the questions I'll finish right now so yeah um, I must admit that Unreal Engine 4 can be useful with all kinds, all kinds of stuff, and um, guys, I love it, and it worked perfectly. It was one of the best contents, contests ever, really, and um, it's just cool. This thing I made in three days, three nights actually, three nights it took me to build all the, all the uh, scripting here. Uh, networking and um, questions really yeah and it worked it really did so thank you uh, I hope you enjoyed that <laughs>